What's up guys, Crumpy here, and uh, today I'm going to be going over Crypto CryptoKitties as promised, and uh, basically what you need, to, what you should avoid, and um, what you need to know about breeding, and uh, basically the gas fees involved um, uh, with the Ethereum network and how it's processed right now, so let's get right into it. Alright guys, so um, I don't have that many kitties, but I've been, I've been with crypto kitties for a while so pretty much since it's launched i've been on and off i haven't bought anything as i when it came out i didn't buy anything i was just pretty much just looking at it and just pretty much just learning uh, the flow so if you're a newcomer starting off what you pretty much want to use is uh, open seed it definitely helps out a lot as far as seeing uh, the, the traits that you want the color that you want um for your crypto kitty so on OpenSea, i'll show you on my account here i have 11 uh, crypto kitties so we can go ahead and click on that um so what i wanted to get into here is uh you know here it is you can you know check the color that you want base color body type the eye color so you can pretty much search all this up on crypt uh for crypto kitties on OpenSea, which is really nice and what's also nice is if you click on the crypto kitty here go to properties you can actually just click on which property you want um, and you can see how rare it is here uh, you know 0.04 percent have this jack trait which is the actual crypto kitty itself that's his name the main crypto kitty website what's good about this one is uh, if you go into crypto kitty like I click on this one you can just scroll down and you can click on this calculator here I'll give you a breakdown of uh, what's rare on your kitty from what's not. So, uh, from zero to five scales uh, is basically the rarity. So I'll show it. I'll give you a breakdown here. What I want to uh, what I want to tell you is basically when it comes to breeding and when it comes to uh, listing pets, uh, anything like that, it's gonna there's gas fees involved. And since there's a lot of people in the market market right now the ethereum network is pretty congested so it's gonna cost you a lot of money just to breed and just to uh list pets so if you actually head to the crypto kitty website it'll tell you here the breeding fee has increased to 0 0.07 ethereum and you can actually join the discord the crypto kitty discord and it'll, it'll show you like a list of uh basically when it's been updated like i want to say last year when you tried breeding it was only about 30 bucks now it's bumped up to about uh a total of 90 dollars so it's not worth it right now guys to, uh, to be breeding your pets unless you want to you want to just uh, spend the money and you don't care about it what i say is going to happen is we're going to have to wait for ethereum uh, 2.0 to come out and hopefully that helps out with the uh the congestion and there's also uh, the flow project that's going to be uh coming out it's basically the people that are making this are the people that created crypto kitties and you can sign up for the, the 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 trial or the the wait you can sign up for the wait list um if you do do that um you might be able to get in i'm still currently waiting to get into the uh, waiting list and i believe going through this blockchain will actually lower the fees on breeding and selling your crypto kitties uh, one other thing i wanted to uh say in this video here is there's two ways to list your crypto kitties on the marketplace you can list it through OpenSea. You know list this item so you're still gonna be dealing with gas fees either way so when you list it on here uh you can set the the highest bid set price bundle and the time frame i bet you'll see here OpenSea takes 2.5 percent of your fee if you list it on cryptokitty.com and avoid that and i believe it's less gas fees doing it this way Oh, I have to be logged in. So once you're logged in, I, I'm not logged in on my actual computer. I'm logged in on my phone. But once you're logged in, you go to Crypto Kitties. Um, from there, you'll see a list button, and then you can list it. You can choose the time frame, and then you could see that I listed one of my Crypto Kitties here. So basically, what happens when you list it? I listed it for 360 days, a whole year. Um, once you list it, it will transfer it to the Crypto Kitty auction house. And then from there, once it sells, if someone buys it, then the uh, funds get transferred over to you. Um, if it doesn't sell, the cat will just come back to your inventory. 
but yeah guys i just wanted to make this short video here um, because there's a lot of new people coming into the marketplace um and they might you know have might have questions about like how do you breed and um is it worth it to breed right now and you know, is there a cheaper way around it uh no there isn't a cheaper way around breeding you're gonna have to deal with those gas fees current right now until again ethereum 2.0 comes out with the uh staking and the, or the the flow network <clears throat> other than that guys probably gonna want to you know actually just buy your crypto kitties right out because it's, it's actually way cheaper than breeding yeah so guys if you want to buy a, a kitty from OpenSea, i would recommend um, going on here um, clicking this and then choosing the cheapest and make sure you you know what color you want um the accent color is basically the middle part of the the kitty so it can have different type of colors in the middle and then the base color is actually the gonna be the uh the fur on the on the outside you can also choose the eye color if you like there's certain type of eyes that you're looking for um the mouth if you don't want it to have a beard you can choose um a certain type of mouth and uh and pattern yeah guys so as far as um breeding compared to buying i would definitely recommend buying your crypto kitty rather than breeding because breeding you're going to run into gas fees just to breed the two uh, cats together then you're also going to run into um, gas fees listing that, that cat and currently those gas fees are super high uh, there might be a correction in the, the market as far as the ethereum market uh, because in the past you know you've seen you know the ups and downs on, uh, on the market and there might be another a drop which could reduce the price 